When I was 12. When I was 12. Lying in my captain's bed in my bedroom. Kneeling on the orange carpet of our downstairs bathroom. I was caught. I was caught. Masturbating by my father. My father was a doctor of psychology. He'd worked in the field roughly 25 years. My father worked at a retread store. He'd been retreading tires since he was 10. My father quickly said, oh, I'm sorry, and closed the door. My father quickly said, what the fuck is this? And I stood there. Sometime after, I wondered if my dad would think I was gay. My father thought I was gay. For the next two weeks, I went around trying to act tough so my dad would know I was normal. For the next six years, I shit with the bathroom door wide open. Nobody was going to really suspect me of anything. Sometime later, my dad came to me and said what I'd done was natural and normal. There was nothing to be embarrassed or ashamed about. Sometime later, my father asked me if I'd ever seen a limp-wristed blind man try to retread a tire. <laughs> well, that experience stayed with me, and today I can feel good about masturbating. Waxing the weasel, choking the chicken, spending some time with the Palm Sisters, it's all perfectly natural. It's all perfectly normal. Late one night at the retreat store, I killed my father in a fit of guilty rage. I spent the next 20 years in prison undergoing daily psychiatric treatments to help curb my violent tendencies. I'm currently on 5,000 milligrams of lithium a day, and this helped me to appear normal in society. I've learned one thing, though. Don't touch yourself! Your penis is a Pandora's box of evil. You open it, and you're going to hell! Thank, Thank you. you. <laughs>